Well, now I'm really confused. Anyway, let's play this game. Woodies. Um, oh, you gotta buy. Yeah, you gotta buy. So. Oh, wow. Wow, that's rubbish. Um, right, let's get a wizard. <laughs> that's gonna help orcs against. <laughs> against. Uh, what else? Uh, all the stars are crap. Unless I can get Varag, which I can't. And he's more expensive than River anyway, so. No star. Could get like. Nothing. Could get just fucked up. A Merc Orc Thrower. <laughs> to, count, to counter the strip ball. No, this is uh Alright, let's go with a wizard. <laughs> Merc Orc Thrower. Ah, so he got so so right the the reason I was a bit confused at the start of the stream for the people watching on YouTube is um I've gotta play next round of my champs ladder match against a monstrous lizardman team that got through yeah yeah exactly that is exactly the jam to us he got he just got a pass game so he won two one no damage whereas what i was hoping was that i was hoping that the wood out the pro elves would have won and taken loads of damage they would have had 11 players uh, like you know a few journeymen and i could have just you know mullered them uh was the plan but now, of course, it's absolutely full strength. A full strength lizard man team is going to be is going to be tough to beat. Um, it's you know just because of the just because the raw strength. He hasn't got a lot of guard, and I have got a lot of guard. But um, still, it's going to be it's going to be incredibly tough just because of the just because of how much strength he has. Right, this guy doesn't have any wizard, but he does have. He's got three rerolls already, so he's got four with a leader. I think that's a bit too much. Maybe he likes a bit of elven bullshit. He hasn't got block on his uh, on his catcher. I should have checked his record. Maybe he's new to Blood Bowl. He's not. He's got a strip dancer though, <laughs> and a TV advantage. So that's probably going to be enough for him to make this. All right. Do you know what I put? I didn't put. I was, they promised to put these on the line, and now I've just not denied it. I could have denied LOS's. That's what I was going to do, and I just didn't do it. Yeah, um, yeah, look, I, <laughs> um, I don't think nobody expected me to beat the Woodies. I think the Woodies were quite beatable because they had 11 players and didn't have a wizard and everything. Um, so, you know. The, the Skaven though were, were absolutely terrifying. There was, I I couldn't see how I I didn't see how I could beat the, the Skaven team. Um, that's true, Don Nicholas. That's very true. <laughs> I'm just gonna base everybody. <laughs> so that's the play right now, because <laughs> you know I've got more strength. He's a Jalifa. He's got loads of rerolls, so the basing unfortunately isn't gonna be that solid. But um, yeah, base everyone every turn. Hope to base, base, base. Hope to base, base, base. This won't fail. I am on the right. Boop, boop, boop. What is this? The base, the versus Pupok. The base that threw it away literally. Oh, I, I, I didn't see the fight. Not missing a black hog, missing a uh, missing a blitzer, but I just randomly, I randomly didn't protect the lineman instead of a blitzer and uh, didn't put black hogs on the LOS because I'm a bit stupid. It's probably just Twitch rather than uh, rather than extra arms. To be fair, on that. Hog. Well, he's he's only played he's only played forty one games in Champs Ladder, so he's um he's probably pretty new to Blood Bowl, isn't he?
Yeah, he, he, I mean, literally, he does look like, doesn't it, 40 games. If he was four, if he played 400 games with that win percentage, you'd say he's bad. Now, obviously, new players start off bad at Blood Bowl, so it's not, it's not an insult to call him bad, is it? <laughs> but yeah, obviously, it looks like the reason he's bad is because he's new. Right. Um. So let's go for the greedy power hit or for the uh, more reliable. Um, hit here. But going for the hit here lets me base more men. Which has got to be good. And for that reason. For that reason, I'm in. Let's just base as many men as possible. Hub dub. Base, base, base. This won't fail. I'm on a nine. See what happens. Hub dub. Base, base, base. <laughs> this won't fail. I'm on the right. 80% with Dark Elves, that's pretty good, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> Damn <Dumb Asia. laughs> It looks like he is going for the passing play, yeah. The classic scoring threat play. It's funny though, the, the herb dirt basing is... Um, only only subs can get it to Kaisu to stop massive spamming of it. <laughs> However, what I stop it, it might be some application of mighty blow. Yeah, yeah, it's not. It's setting up for a pass is usually not a not the play, is it? It's just re basically potatoing <laughs> preemptive potato, <laughs> letting you blitz a high value player. For no real reason. I mean, he does have four rerolls, to be fair, so he's, you know, his dodging away with everybody isn't going to look so bad. Like, bad odds wise. I mean, it's, it's funny that the stupid herb dirt base, base, base is actually pretty effective against. Near rookie with woodies normally he'd only have two. I mean, if this was an even TV game, he'd only have two re rolls, wouldn't he? Um, so like that's that's huge to be fair. But instead of two, he's got four, so he, he can just safely two, two plus everyone away here every turn. It's gonna be tough to score as well because of that. Sad times, right? You go there. You go back. He's on potato watch.
Yeah, well, he's new, isn't he? Let's let's be fair. He's new to football. I'm taking a good 15 seconds for my turn to to balance it out. He's got sidestep, so it didn't matter really which way I blitzed him from. Fend. That was really horrible blitz. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> yeah, don't be mean. Let's not be mean. It's a non mean stream now. No means, just memes. <laughs> The dumbest farmers get the biggest potatoes. <laughs> Essentially, yes, it does. Oh, look, me basing him just gave him a free assist. Unbelievable, Jeff. Um, yeah. I mean, that is that it does apply with Blood Bowl coaches. Obviously, you shouldn't call people dumb. Um, but yes, obviously, if you're the worst players try more things that need more luck, don't they? Oh shit, my phone's out of battery. Yeah, I'll just go and, go and fucking charge my phone up. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's that's it, Dorvian. Yeah, exactly. So if you if you tr only try safe moves and everything, and well ordered plays, when you fail, it's not that disastrous, and when you succeed, it's not that glamorous. Whereas making like a zombie pass to another zombie or something, <laughs> equally, you know, low odds, makes it look like they're luckier, doesn't it? Mmm. No block there, sadly. I want to make this a three dice, but on the other hand, I don't want to uh, commit people. Also, I'd like to blitz through, wouldn't I, and put pressure on. Gonna go, gonna go for the hub dub, base, 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 with everybody, <laughs> naturally. <laughs> uh, I gotta power him first. Blitz with a black orc, just so that um, just that you can go on base afterwards. <laughs> they don't need an assist that isn't basing anybody. Kind of annoying because obviously I'm fishing for a pal to put pressure on. I guess I should do it with both. <laughs> Some serious basing of men's here. Uh, 
has the power I was looking for. Right. So now... What do I do? Make him... Box him in? Or box him in? I mean, his only player really is doing a pass or not doing a dodging everyone away. I can't get anyone behind him. Powell there would have been amazing to get people in behind and put a bit of pressure on Folsom to make the pass play. This will put two two bases on the receive if he goes for a pass. Well, I get obviously basing more people has to be the right player. It doesn't make any dodges out harder, but there's more people, more players base, which at the end of the day is what this team wants the most, isn't it? Maximum basing. Hello, Mipha. Um, not really, to be honest. Yes, first action one. That's what we love. Rest of his turn, terrifying. <laughs> oh, my no, I'm not actually excited for the next round of playoffs because my opponent got a bye and has his full team and also it's the scarier of the two teams, really. I fancy my chances against the, the Pro Elves just because, like I fancy my chances against the Wood Elves, sure that, you know, if they pop the ball loose it's terrifying, but if they don't, just grind them to dust and, uh, you know, 11-man team is what I was hoping for. <laughs> very good at Dominic Kevin. So, uh, you know, I mean, obviously, look, he's got a chance. I've got a lot of guard, um, and he hasn't got much guard, so he's always got a lot of strength. So, um, I might get lucky. I've got I've got quite a lot of might as well. Yeah, exactly, Wolf Bark. <laughs> yeah, an easy match against 2.2k Chaos. Yeah. I mean, I did already beat that team, but he wasn't 2.2k when I beat them. Yeah, I do like all the stand for him. It is, it is surprisingly good, isn't it? Yes, Hummerzep. He's he's pretty new to Blood Bowl, I think. Definitely new at Champs Ladder. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's true. You might as well concede if you beat someone three times. Hey, but it's the last one. Right, is there any is there any pressure on the ball? Blitz this guy and then do I even need to blitz him to get pressure on him? No. So he can simply move up. Don't know if they make this three dice or not. You can GFI the base at the end. <laughs> oh, he's basing there already. Perfect. Up, up. Base, base, base. <laughs> right. So, I mean, three dice would be good, wouldn't it? And it's not really that much of a commitment. And now he's going to be based wherever he sidesteps to. Get banged on. So dance a lot. <laughs> he's got a great name. He doesn't have block, but he's got a great name. Right. 
One, two, three, four. Oh God, I've I've literally got to go for it twice here. Just because I, I, you know, I had four re rolls, and I thought he can just switch it on me here, can't he? He can get to there with a war dancer. So. I mean, I didn't have to run all that way around, really. Because I could just take him, and then after he went there, I could have then moved to there anyway. So I was only stopping. I wasn't really stopping him going. My, yeah, it was, it was pretty stupid running around the way I did. But let's ignore that I've completely misplayed. Yeah, screw up, dude. I didn't care. I literally didn't care. That was, but I mean, it wasn't. I should have cared. <laughs> I should have done them one at a time. And if I failed the first one, not done the second. Absolutely, but I just didn't care. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI. Yeah, yeah. One would have been enough to cover the, the dancer. He's taking his two dice blocks. Good boy. Better than Andy Davo, confirmed. Silent Bob. Oh yeah, well, the dancers are uh, Rudolph and Blitzer. Don't know, I thought it said Derna then, I was like, oh nice. See, this guy is new, but he, he's better than Andy Dave or Andy Narian. So, you know, good for him there. So dancing. One throw handed off to the other throw. That's fucking top tactics, that, innit? Let's keep him back now. So I'd have to blitz him to get an assist on there, which I want. Could I chain him? Yes, but it'd have to be a one dice. It'd be really good though, wouldn't it? That's it's too good. Too good to not do. I can't chain him because I can't get a player in there. Oh well. Could blitz him to get a two dice on him. All right. <laughs> That's the hope to face, face, face. GFI in. Can't do that. GFI there, then he could 2D, then he could try and get in somewhere. He could not do anything. He's got a 2 plus out and then a pass to him, hasn't he? Which is fortunately too, too fucking good. All right. GFI have to be made, and then he can go there. And then a GFI there, and a 2D there, and it's about the best I can do. Loner GFI.
Oh yeah. <laughs> Just uh, casually not understanding how assists work there. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, yeah, I'm as that. You can tell. Look, I'm fucking ill. You can tell that I'm fucking ill, can't you? Oh, Christ. Should have stood this guy on the uh, on the logo to make him more camouflaged. <laughs> yeah, exactly, I don't they, Kelly? <laughs> I mean, this is the team to use while little, isn't it? Just base everybody every turn and see what happens. He'd be out of rerolls now. He should be out of rerolls, really, if he had a normal team. And if this was if this was an, if this was a fair match, he'd be out of rerolls right now. And and the basing strategy. I mean, this was the wrong strategy to employ in this game if I was just trying to win at all costs, purely because he's got those rerolls. Um, but it's fun, isn't it? It's fun to have that base, base, base. Yeah, that's a good point, Rest of Alan. Yeah, that's a, that's a, it's good. It's a handy thing, isn't it? The the ultimate is to have a a jump up orc, and then fail the fail the GFI in 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 this circle. Run here until you fail the GFI, and then he'll never see me if he's prone. <laughs> Nope, GFI to run back a square. Classic. <laughs> yeah, the troll, the hiding people behind the troll is number one. Number one stat is number one stat, number one strat. That's the thing, look, basing people is just dumb, isn't it? I'll completely out of position. Fails the last dodge. He doesn't even care. Base the ball here. <laughs> It'll be by not blitzing with 90 blow. Which, as much as I would like to hurt the base, 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 that seems like not the way to do it. Should have done that basing before this basing. Right. Inconsequential block first. Seems good. Yeah, the wizard's for when he steals the ball off me. Which he surely will do. Okay, well that's that, that, that's that plan fucked. <laughs> oh man, orcs are pretty slow, aren't they? Today I learned orcs are, orcs are slower than wood elves. I didn't learn it. I already knew. Look how clever I am. to make them both anyway. Have to base the ball. Maybe I should have gone there actually. <laughs> hey! <laughs> 
That was quite a good, that was quite a good both down and no balls, wasn't it? <laughs> Leveled up. <laughs> Levels up with that catastrophic failure. <laughs> he's managed to stall out perfectly here, hasn't he? Look at now. Yeah, I think maybe he's, maybe he's moving him to here would have been better, wouldn't it? I think maybe he's in the wrong square. Got him, boss. <laughs> so the, the ball, car ball carrier can't score. Might be going for the dodge out handoff to dance at the score. Fail something. No. Two plus three plus to score, isn't it? And I got a two turn, the two re rolls, and uh, oh, oh, we might fail. <laughs> Outrageous. Absolutely outrageous, Jeff. I'll just wait a little bit to see if the concede comes. <laughs> the surf is not easy, is it? I read on a one dice. But that's like the best way to do it is by one dicing, isn't it? Right. Yeah, obviously that's the one. That, that's the only one that I really want to surf. <laughs> He can blitz him and then, and then, surf him. But that requires a one dice, and also doesn't clear the ball. Or I could just block him on the ball and then surf him. And that requires someone from up here. Or a one dice. Do I want to scatter it? This seems so bad. Oh baby, I'm so lucky. Paper. Orcs don't care about the paper. Orcs live to base. And chain surf war dances. Uh, only a kill. Yeah, there was a lot of risk there, wasn't there? There was a lot of risk. <laughs> Fuck the paper. <laughs> um, right, he 
Egan. He can go in there to protect him. He can stay next to him. Don't have a scoring threat. Two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> 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 nah, no gym foul. Right. <laughs> the classic Black Hawk scoring threat. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a reroll. This probably isn't even that bad odds. You could you could work it out on Samba. <laughs> yeah, the the orc the orc uh, GFI fails are amazing. They're the best animations in the game, probably. All right, ball scatter. Straight to the black oak. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> right. Right, black oak needs to blitz. He dodges out and passes to him in the end zone. Easy. Oh, which is the best, better play? No, I can't pass it to him in a tackle zone, can it? It's got to be... I don't know, though. No, it's already a four. It's only going to be a five. Lad. Oh man. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot I could have surfed. No, there's no one I could surf. Oh yeah, I could have surfed this guy, yeah. Yeah. Oh man. <laughs> that was pretty close, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> the fucking Black Hawk scoring threat. <laughs> fucking crazy. Yeah, the, it was the fucking Lino. It wasn't the uh, the Black Hawk. Was he was there? He had sure hands of the Black Hawk. He was ready to get it. Oh wow, he set up already. Oh god. Alright, maybe this is the this is the game that I get a competition. <laughs> and he has got one more answer on the pitch. Which to be fair is pretty pretty fucking scary having one more answer. Um But I also have one mighty blow guy. Right, just set up against the blitz. Is it the most effective setup? No, but it's it, it does it does protect against the blitz a bit, doesn't it? Yeah, plus one plus one Gandalf, yeah. Yeah. I get another reroll. Yeah, no, that he's got four now plus the leader. Brutal. Right, I've got to make this pick up, and he, I've got to not let him split the team in half as well. Got to chew dice the dancer, so I've got to make this block.
He's got to get based. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. So if I uh, just need a push here, I can two dice the dancer. These guys need to come back, don't they? Lucky boy. Keep him based. Right, just got to fucking kill the dancer here, have another this mighty blow hit. Roll a pal. Make a Kaz. Halfway there. Oh, time for a gym foul next turn. <laughs> um, obviously, hopefully a ducky foul, but... We'll hope for a ducky foul, it'll probably be a gym foul, but you know, I only make them when I'm happy with a with a stun for a send off, so hey. Put him on the mighty ball guy. It gives him an assist, easy, but also if he just stands him up he, he gets hit, doesn't he? Poor old Lona getting banged on. Like, this is the weakness of Wood Elves, isn't it? Obviously, any team could have lost four players in the first half, but Wood Elves are a lot likely, to, more likely to lose four in the first half than, like, Orcs are. And they're not out of it when they lose four, which is what's good about Wood Elves still, isn't it? Whereas if Orcs were set with four players down, they've lost guaranteed, basically. Or Chaos, or you know, anybody else. Any other team, four players down, would have guaranteed lost at this point. But, um... <laughs> but they're not even done, which is crazy. Protecting with just one guy. Right. Where can I make the cage? Up here. That's good enough, isn't it? Right. Let's think about this. Oh, fuck. He could come in there. One, two, three, four. He could go there, and then him there, and him there. Then he could go one, two, three, four. He could blitz, then he could foul. Yeah. So, he does want to come in to here. Oh, he can go there for the assist, so he can come in to here. Can't get there. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. That's fucking sign on for you. It looks then They're like, oh, you can get there without a GFI, but. He couldn't. A roll that I didn't need to make. Misplay. He, he, I, he could have just come here and the cage would have still been strong enough. Hello, Ducky. Yeah, 
Yes. Well, that was worth a reroll, wasn't it? And worth getting sent off. Worth a reroll than a player. So, yeah, I should have moved him first. I was surprised when it, when it, you know, I thought I couldn't reach there. And then I looked and thought, oh, I can reach there. But obviously I couldn't. I couldn't reach there. And I shouldn't have. Should have thought about it more, but I'm really, I honestly, I am really ill at the moment. And, uh, not so much ill as in a lot of pain. So I just, it's, it's hard to think. And it's why, it's why I have been very negative in the past a lot of the time as well, to be honest. Um, you know, it's hard to not let it affect you. But, playing Herb Derp Orc or Herb Derp Base 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 Orcs is quite, quite turn your brain off isn't it maybe they would have counted it out but again it's i think it is with the way the client works you know if i was if i was playing on a blue like playing if we were playing on a board i would have counted out the squares wouldn't i but you know on fumble i would have counted out the squares but i guess i just need to not pay attention to the client and still count out the squares every time <sighs> Brainless Orcs. He didn't even base the ball. Which is outrageous, isn't it? Don't need to move up far. Do need to blitz with Mighty Bow. I can't not blitz with Mighty Bow. I'm, I'm allergic to not blitzing with Mighty Bow. I'm blocking. <laughs> <laughs> Schnitzel in in uh, in Germany, little Baz. <laughs> yeah, it's hard for them. I mean, it's hard for them to do the uh, to do something like that. Yeah, exactly, Ducky. It's not easy, is it? Because you, you'd have to have loads of overlays. Because there's loads of ways you can get to that square, you know. So it could be with a GFI or it could be with a dodge, and it's just really hard to, uh, to, it would be really hard to do it. <laughs> Training bit, I don't know why I'm really doing this with <laughs> Yeah, well, you know, it's one of those things, isn't it? When you're dominating a game, you play loose and make mistakes in the same way as when you're really getting crushed in the game, you'll, and you kind of give up mentally a little bit, as sometimes happens um, to everybody. And obviously, sometimes it's justified that you've given up. Like, you know, this guy has basically got no chance now that his dancers are out. I don't blame him for giving up mentally, and uh, I don't blame myself for um, also, you know, letting up mentally because it is pretty much done, isn't it? But, you know, still, things could still happen. Let's get a mighty blow hit. A Kaz. No Kaz. Let's get him up here. Where's the other blitzer that wants to score? Is that this one? Right. About run my cage like a <laughs> like an orc thrower. <laughs> oh dear me.
That's the better square piece to square, isn't it? If I beast here, you could have blocked two dice block, whereas now he's, he's got no two Ds. Schnitzel in ages. I am not schnitzel in ages. I didn't have it in England, obviously, and then I haven't had it since I've been back in Germany. Isn't that fucking crazy? Eating fucking healthily, man. I've had loads of fucking broccoli and rice, but I haven't had a schnitzel. The fuck's wrong with me? Rip, rip mighty blow guy getting his level this game. Yeah, it should be with back, yeah, it should, but still, the auto pass shouldn't make you, you know, like, look, if... If, let's say, I move this guy to here, right? The auto move shouldn't take me through all of these. And it's clunky to have to go, uh, 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 isn't it? Having to do that is shit. But you should be able to click there and go there. You shouldn't click here and it takes you one, two, three, four, which it does a lot of times. I'm running out of time to attempt this pass here. <laughs> as much as I want to do it, I think uh, the chances of it are diminishing. Right, let's make make a two dice block first. Howdy, howdy. That means we get to make a foul. Pretty exciting. Because had it just been a push, um, I would have got another block out of it, but now that it was a power, he'll complete the cage and he can make a foul on that powerful loner. Oh, he won't get to make a foul because all the double there. But at least he's basing somebody already, so that's good, isn't it? <laughs> Path trolling is up. Yeah, that's true down the coast. Very good, yeah, that's very that's a very good point. Yeah, very good point. Very good point. Gone for the fucking. He's gone for the guy who I want to score with. God damn it! Two rerolls. I'm, I'm not going to do the pass anymore. Although I'd have loved to have done the pass. Now the the time is over. They're being nil nil. If it was one nil, I'd think about going for the pass. But I'm not even going to consider it now. Face him. <laughs> Face these guys. Face him. <laughs> Some glorious basing going on. Blitz with a carrier. And that, that was me done by uh, auto pathing. No, it wasn't. I think I, think I did myself. Uh... <laughs> I was just I was just shit and wrong. 
but that could have been done by auto passing. But then that would have been okay. That would have been okay auto passing. I don't know if it's a fuck up or not. Got two turns. I should really have got f further forward this turn, shouldn't I? I really want to power him though, and then cage around him and foul him. <laughs> yeah, puss baby. Absolute puss baby. Yeah, true. The, the way should be able to force through the score, shouldn't it? Manly puss baby. That was brilliant, wasn't it? Hey! <laughs> yeah, I'd totally go for the pass here if if the game was won, which obviously it isn't. My, well, the game wouldn't be won now anyway, would it? But if it was one nil, I would consider the game done. Two, three, four, five, six. This is a bit crap, isn't it? I haven't relied on this foul. But it'll be done by a black orc because being stronger makes your fouls more likely to work, doesn't it? That's what the rule book tells me. Glorious. Great timing, Villa Hoppier. <laughs> Timed with the Orc Foul. <laughs> the Orc Black Orc Foul. <laughs> Thanks for staying fantastic. Wow, 50% chance of failure to start the turn. Bold. I mean, he's got no cho choice. I'm not really criticising him. Though. <laughs> Thank you very much for the resub. Especially as I've been. Yeah, of course, the last turn bolt just falls through the score, isn't it? I mean, it's either. It's just, you know, the bolt was just defensive for if, uh, if they steal it or if, you know. Or if. To, to force a score through, and obviously now it's to force a score through. Three, four, five, six, seven. Doesn't fuck me, does it? One, two. One, two, three, four, five, seven. No, it doesn't fuck me. Has on the last turn. Right. 
Red Reindeer Running Club. That's why he's got like Donner and Blitzen. Yeah, didn't pick up the score. <laughs> oh man, can't believe I picked the score before. <laughs> yeah, it's cool too. <laughs> Quite. I like that I saved a suboptimal setup with the LOS there, but never mind. Level Lino can stick him on the line because fucking. Don't think you'll know how to one turn. But you never know. You never know. <laughs> That's probably what some people would think or it answers. <laughs> You, you jest, <laughs> but um, yeah, obviously, I could have obviously played it a lot better that half, but once once the dancer was gone, it was it was over, wasn't it? Seeing as I wasn't gonna try a pass. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, yeah, exactly. But um I don't I don't do that. And you know it's it's worth it in OCC. You know that's the thing in OCC I should I should do it in uh I should do it in It's it's not just his style, it's well it well, it was his style in Champs Ladder that was that was pretty crazy with his off team when he did it, but um, it's it's the right play in these in these long term leagues. It really is. Who cares if you if you lose because of it? It just doesn't matter, does it? Yeah. Yeah, cake of death, that's true. No, anyway, it was a two plus three plus with a reroll, wasn't he? Um which and and then a two plus dodge, so yeah, it was pretty he was pretty close. Right, let's see what this is. This has gotta be guard this time. Yeah, movement be movement's kind of all right, but not as a first skill. Edge first is okay, but um, I'm not gonna go dirty play for two reasons. One, it's lower TV, so I would rather I value block more. But then also, you know, I don't have twelve players. Also, he's on twelve star player points, so he's get he's up to getting his second skill quicker, isn't he? So dirty player gets worse. If he's on six dirty player, it'd be more tempting. Gotta go guard. Uh, my mouse isn't working. Uh, oh God. <laughs> um. <laughs> right. Uh, too too unreliable, Ducky, because um. It is pretty good, but not first skill. Not first skill. And long term, it's good. If I was in OCC or UKBBL or BBT or Rebel, I could have uh, I could have taken movement. But um, you know. Right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.